Today, I'm going to be showing you a hidden input delay tweak that pros don't want you to know about. So make sure to watch to the end and subscribe if this works. Getting straight into this, the first thing you want to do is press the Windows key and type in system information. Now you want to click hardware resources, go down to IRQs and scroll down until you find your GPU. Now you can type it in here, but I'm just going to scroll because I'm a demon. There we go. Bang, I found it. So now what you want to do is there's an IRQ number. So it's basically this little number after where it says IRQ. Just highlight it. It, click in here. This is where you can type it. Now you need to type it in a very particular way. So type in IRQ, put this little bracket thing, and now type out the number. You can't copy and paste this, so you will have to literally type it. And once you've typed that out, close the bracket like so, and then just copy it. Now we only typed it here for convenience because what you want to do is press your Windows key. Now go to Registry Editor. You then want to click this little top tab, Directory Search, take away everything, and copy and paste the first thing in the description. I'll label them as like number one, two, three, four, because there'll be a few of them. But it is super simple. Just copy and paste this. You'll see. Press enter. And when you're here, you want to make a new D word 32 bit value. And because you may have copy and pasted that, you will want to go back here and also grab this. So hopefully you didn't close that. But paste your IRQ number like so and remove the brackets like this. What we have done here is we have set Windows scheduler priority of the GPU to high and prioritized interrupts from the GPU. This ensures all GPU instructions are executed first and reduces input delay. But that isn't all. Now go to number two in the description and copy and paste this. It will take you to M. MCSS, just make sure that is correct. You'll be in this little folder here. Double click start and change this to zero times two. Sometimes it won't let you type it out. So what you need to do is literally copy and paste zero times two into here. Then you can press okay. Now let's go to the next location, copy and paste. You may already have it, but if you have something in here called lazy mode, that is great. If not, you want to create a new D word value and call it lazy mode. So literally just like lazy mode, make sure it is case sensitive. You then want to double click in here and change the value to one. And then again, if you don't already have it, create a new D word value called lazy mode mode timeout and set this value to this right here 0x6188 this will massively decrease your overall system input lag by reducing non-urgent tasks from being scheduled which overall allows for games to be ran for longer periods of times on any given cpu cycle in short this allows for more fps and also less input delay to be a little bit more specific everything i've shown you so far will reduce your system's input lag or input delay by over 25 percent but to take it even further i'm going to use a tool called Swift Tricks, developed by a Windows engineer, which is designed to completely optimize the PC for FPS and input delay. All I have to do is navigate over to their new latency tab. And while I wait for the new Swift Core Affinity feature to find the best core on my CPU, I'm going to enable GPU interrupt priority, enable latency optimizations, and I'm going to set prioritize to input delay. And lastly, enable ultra low latency mode. Once the best core is found, select your mouse from the drop down, and you'll see Swift Core Affinity is now active. The last thing to do is to head over to the BIOS optimizations and optimize our BIOS for input delay. Swiftrix uses a custom implementation similar to the tool known as Skewin to modify the BIOS from Windows, which saves me so much time. I don't have to go to the BIOS myself and potentially break my PC. It's all done for me in less than 30 seconds. All right, guys, I'm in game right now. My edits are feeling super smooth. It's almost instantaneous. Like I have not played in a long time and my triple edits are on point. I'm going to leave a link to the tool Swift Tricks in the description. If you guys want to check it out, please feel free. Out of every tool out there right now, I highly recommend it. I don't think anything else has improved my FPS and input delay this much. 